Malik, uh, the train continues, five and a half out of six. This right. must be the tournament of your life, uh, your initial reaction to this incredible result after six rounds. Yeah, I'm actually very much surprised. I don't know what's going on. I'm, it is the tournament of my life. I mean, I'm playing well. I mean, I don't know, I'm trying. Uh, I'm working every day myself, and it looks like so far everything works perfectly. I, again, I knew about this opening, I predicted I kind of got prepared for this, and um, I don't know. Um, I was in my. I, I thought he's going to play French, but then he played this e45. Then I figure I didn't want to like a deal with this Berlin with uh, not f6 um, because the only good game he played in this tournament, in my opinion, it was a game against Benjamin. I mean, when he, he was winning, in fact. Yeah, he was yes. winning. Yeah, he was clearly like uh, if he would play like not not take d3, he was like pretty much crushing there. Yes. So I figure he's going to repeat this. I also found his old games back to 70s, 80s when he played uh, e4, knight c6, knight f3, f I mean f5, f5, right? Yeah, e f d5. Mm -hmm. Then I had some prepare something there as well. Uh, but then I knew he's going to play e5. He's going to get back to this like um, because he was expected from me to play the Rui Lopez or Italian. Mm -hmm. And I thought, okay, so this is actually a very tricky line. This is one of the lines which, in my opinion, are very underrated. Kind of uh, this knight c3 underestimated. line for yeah. uh, four knights and yeah. This is considered Actually, to be I believe, some sort I of believe, a by the way, equality. in my opinion, I'm right. wrong, but I think CD is an accuracy. CD? Yeah. Okay. How come? Well, because I think bishop g4 is a much better move. Bishop to g4 first. Okay. Yeah. Very interesting. Yeah, That's this true. is about, yeah, then bishop h5, and then we have dc, queen d4 check, king h1, mm -hmm. bishop c3, mm -hmm. all these positions. So, so. Nepomnia, she versus Karamana yeah. games. Yeah. I see Le a lot Le of games. Lebron played it, yeah, right. many times against my Mediara. So, this is like a very well known position. So this is h3, yeah, actually h6 is also, I'm not sure, because people usually play like c6 uh, right away. First, yeah, allows yeah. bishop g5, yeah. then h6 and things of that nature. Well, why do you feel like this is underrated? Well, I wanted to get position something like this. I okay. wanted to get slightly, a slightly tiny edge and for the long game and keep You pressing. should uh, thank your coach, right? Yes, uh, yeah, coach, <laughs> by the way. Yeah. <laughs> what? what? Thank you. I also have, by the way, another coach, um, <laughs> my good friend, uh, Buddy Thompson from Phoenix, Arizona. He also, like, he's uh, my student, like, he's my good friend. He's also, like, telling me, like, what should I do? How should I behave? You know, <laughs> all this stuff. <laughs> but, like, fun. Because um, anyway. you asked me yesterday, like, how should I, should I be aggressive? Should I Right, be? right, right, right. You yeah, know, I mean, you made some interesting hand motions. You know, so. I knew <laughs> how to behave, how to play the game, but I just wanted to confirm. Yes, yes, very good, very good. <laughs> all right. So, yeah, but I mean, I, I got what I wanted, and uh, I think uh, after all the straights, uh, yeah, I thought I'm supposed to be better. Yeah, bishop e6, I, I don't know, I, I didn't like more bishop e6. Right. Yeah. He was trying too much to exchange the pieces. Right, exactly. I like... think bishop must be on this diagonal to protect the f5 square. That's right, on e6 in general. Right. Says. So, yeah, queen d4, d4, it's, I think it's a blunder, d4. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, I thought it's a blunder, because, no positional blunder, Let's because... See. Um, yes. He's supposed to stay like uh, stay chill, you know, like queen d6, queen c7. It's about equal. But when not easy also because you have the knight yeah, coming to Yeah, I know, I know, I know. I mean, I have some prospects for sure. Yeah. Uh, but when he put that e4, it's actually uh, much more. I mean, after rook e1, I thought I'm actually uh, better. You are, yes. Yeah. But then I start to like um, kind of. Uh, I did like my way, my play. Yeah, I mean, kind of queen g4 was a bad move. Okay. I missed, um, I thought, I mean, I uh, have some kind of, you know, whatever, like uh, vision to uh, jump on d7 uh, with the rook uh, and blah, blah, blah. Mm -hmm. But it's, it wasn't right. It's supposed to be, say, consolidated, like control diagonal, make sure that nothing's going on, maybe rook e3. Not easy, right? I mean, yeah, the, the material yeah, yeah. is very limited. No, no, no I know, I know. But then I realized after queen g4, h5, queen d1 here, I realized, okay, my, my plan is supposed to be get back to control this diagonal mm -hmm. and try to see, like, what's going on in the game. Uh-huh. Yeah. So you assess this end Yeah, but I think, I think he can trade it. I mean, that, I think it's whenever he trade the rooks. I, I'm not sure about, like, uh, I think, by the way, mistake was when he uh, played uh, rook king f8. Yeah, on king f3, he's supposed to be doing check. I thought it's check. It's important to check here. Maybe kick you on d2, right. yes. Yeah. And somehow hold this position. I'm not sure if it's holdable or not, but he can allow me to to play king d4 and uh, keep yeah, getting to that towards the pawn, yeah. No, it's not an easy end game. Right, because when he plays king f8, now king d4 is challenging, because if he don't play rook d7, then I'm going to go uh, king c5, uh, game over. Yes. Yeah. 
But <clears throat> but the end game, I think, is supposed to be lost. It is. Lost, right? I was right, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I yeah. don't think you ever... Uh, yeah, but I mean, F1, is, is it right plan, F3, G4? You have a couple of plans here. Okay. I think this is one of them. I believe H4 was also but working. B5 I sure was H4. also working. Yeah. yeah, B5, then get the king to uh, E5, and then F4, F5 with yeah. the pawn on H4. I was, I was looking for that, yeah. But I, I thought F3 is most accurate. In my, I, I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. I thought F3 to create like a second passer. Yeah, seems to work. And then to nail the pawn structure. Yeah. No, no, I, don't I, yeah. I don't think you ever let him off the hook. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I don't, I, 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 pawn, a pawn is supposed to be lost, yeah. But this is the most important <laughs> moment of the game, I have to tell you, because we have a huge argument here. And okay. I told them, oh, that's what I'm King C5 Queen A1 also. is the easy win. Yeah. King C, they were saying King C7, yeah, yeah, King yeah, C7, yeah. Malik and I told them, no, 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 Malik that's is not going to calculate, yeah, that's come greedy. on, forget about Queen that. Queen A1 is like a classic, come on. Classic, thank yeah. you, thank you, all right. <laughs> Any questions, guys, because I have no questions. We were done with my questions. so unhappy. We I rest my case. We were trying to vote Christian off the show, and we were saying if you had played the move King C7, we would have carried you around the streets of St. Louis. <laughs> <laughs> and it, it looked like you were touching you, you know, the king, you, know, you were about yeah, to play so King C7. Yeah, so my hand wanted to play King C5. <laughs> right. Right. But then I thought it's kind of, you know, nah, nah. Destiny. Is... I call it destiny, yes. <laughs> I call it <laughs> <laughs> But Malik, uh, one important question. You were saying at the beginning of the show that he doesn't have ambition, right? You were saying that you are just here to play chess. But now you have two points lead. Maxim Glugi lost today. Uh, so how is your mindset changing? Because you have just three rounds to go. Giant advantage leading the tournament. Uh, how do you feel? Uh, no pressure. Tomorrow is new day, new game. Just uh, continue playing uh, as nothing's going on. Mm -hmm. Because there is a, a, every player here, it's like you know selected one, very strong one. So you can't relax in the, on this field. So right. tomorrow I'm playing Gre Gregory. I mean one of the most experienced players. So, and we always had like a tough games against each other. Mm -hmm. So tomorrow is going to be, I guess, a task for me if I deserve to, uh, to you know, be in the first place or something like that. We'll see. Right. Yeah, nice. but there's no pressure. I'm getting more relaxed, meditating. <laughs> I mean, with two-point lead, who wouldn't be relaxed? I feel very relaxed. <laughs> Our congratulations. Very, thank very, you, very, thank very, you, very, very thank nicely you, Katerina, done. Thank you, Katerina. Thank you, Christian. Boy, your like support is valuable. Thank you very much. <laughs> Invaluable thank you, support. Yeah, no, other. <laughs> no problem. No. Oh, oh. But this King C7, C7 we still feel hurt. That was a delicious hurt. moment. We still feel oh. it's too much. It's Boy, too that much. That would have been great. I mean, could he want? Get on G4 and yes, then... tell them, tell them, Malik. Yeah, tell put them. it in like, uh, no moves, come on. I mean. <laughs> Moving on! <laughs> you know, catch your breath, you know, kind of, uh, it's easier, right? It's true, it, it, it's true. I will uh, be a couple of 20 minutes before that, so, so no. <laughs> We're having too much fun here, folks. Uh, yeah, uh, Pat.